What's up guys, this is Eric from b -Side. Today we have installed our plug and play CarPlay Android Auto Retrofit to this Toyota Land Cruiser. Let me go ahead and just show you how everything works. This is the upgraded version, so it's a little different than the one that we had before. So first of all, this is the factory screen and before we get in, you want to make sure your phone is connected to the car's Bluetooth. It's not connected, but it should be connected. And after you connect it, keep it at the Bluetooth audio because all the audio is going to be pushed through the car's Bluetooth audio. So no longer are we going to be selecting the auxiliary, we're going to be selecting Bluetooth audio, turn by turn direction, music, Siri, all the audio is going to be routed through the Bluetooth audio. So once you have that set, go ahead and push and hold the nav button which will switch over the screen. You'll see this three icon screen. Um, this is a screen that you'll get when nothing is connected. So we're going to do our first initial connection. We'll go to your phone on the iPhone, go to settings, go to general and then CarPlay. And then we're going to see it under other cars. Go ahead, select this MV17W. Go ahead and pair. Go ahead and um, we're not going to allow because it's not our, our vehicle. We're going to just go ahead and wait. Okay, there it is. So all the controls will work. Your track up and down where it works. Your volume up and down will also work as well. Your phone pickup and hang up will also work. The voice command is locked to the factory Toyota system, so that will not work. In addition, you can also use this track up and down as well. And if you want to summon Siri, you could go ahead and press and hold this. And if you want to adjust the Siri voice, what you could do is go ahead and summon Siri from your phone. And then you could raise and lower the Siri's volume. So all this swipe motion works as well. And then if you want to go back to your factory screen, press and hold the nav. All right, and then press and hold the nav again to go inside the CarPlay. And all the 360 camera functions will remain. You could push this, see the 360, push it again, side, and go back to CarPlay. Same thing, reverse gear comes out like normally. You take it out, it'll go back to CarPlay. All right, so let me go ahead and disconnect my phone. Easiest way is go to your settings and turn off both your Wi-Fi and your Bluetooth. All right, that will disconnect your phone and we're gonna go ahead and connect our Android. Just go to your Bluetooth and then we're gonna look for the device under available devices. Here it is. Go ahead and pair. All right, we're gonna give it a moment. Okay, here it is. And all the controls are the same, um, all the Track up and down, volume up and down also works. Pick up, hang up also works as well. And these track up and down also works. All right guys, well that concludes our demonstration of our CarPlay Android Auto Retrofit for this Toyota Land Cruiser. If you have any questions, leave a comment below or you can email us at info at bsonicusa.com. And if you haven't yet, help us by liking and subscribing to our channel. Thank you very much and I'll see you guys in the next video.